got pole position. We're all ready for tomorrow's race, but before we begin, let's have a quick look at those who'll be fronting the grid. Surfer Girl, Russell and Max Verstappen. With qualifying complete, all that remains now is the main event. We'll be live and uninterrupted for the Grand Prix tomorrow, so make sure you join us then. OK, mate, so unfortunately we've picked up some grid penalties and we are going to start tomorrow's race further back than we expected. I don't know how bad it's going to get yet, because that's going to depend on everyone else. All we can do is control our own performance, and I know you're good at that. Welcome along then to the North Sea coast and to the Zandvoort circuit. We're 25 miles away from Amsterdam for today's Dutch Grand Prix. It's a race the great Jim Clark won on four occasions, leading for an astonishing total of 370 laps. A lap of this short 2.6 mile Zandvoort circuit features 14 corners, 10 to the right and four to the left, with a 678 meter main straight heading into turn one, Tarzan Corner. And on that straight with DRS open, that'll be the best overtaking opportunity on this track. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. George Russell will begin today's event in pole position and the smooth operator Carlos Sainz completes the front row. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Maldonado, Hamilton, Leclerc, Perez, Norris, Fernando Alonso, Magnussen, Sonoda, Ocon, Verstappen, Joe, Gasly, Albon, Surfer Girl, Bottas, Oscar Piastri, Stroll, Holkenberg, De Vries, and Logan Sargent. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. Formation lap gets underway then and it's going to be interesting today to see how the dry conditions could affect the lifespan of the tyres.
All's okay. Now stay alert for threats around you. DRS will be enabled this lap. You can use it when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. Got a lot of spare energy, okay to use your overtake button. Great maneuver, you made it look so easy.
car ahead's beginning to pull away, you know what to do. seconds. Okay, they're on old softs. They're currently fifth. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 16.5. One more stop. Your last lap time was a 1.16.7. And you're closing by four tenths a lap. Keep it going.
rain expected, no rain expected for the time being. Dryers definitely seem like the fastest tyre at the moment. about the tyre condition for now, everything's looking good. We're currently trailing our teammate by 3.8 seconds. tyres. We think they've got one more stop. The time last lap was a 1 minute 17.6. Take and burn off some of this energy. Thank <laughs> you. 
Brilliant. Nice move. Keep going. Sights ahead. They're on old mediums. We think they've got one more stop. And the time last lap was a 117.9. In this lap, in this lap, push now. Grip is probably dropping due to wear, so don't be too aggressive. ahead. Okay, here's the gap that we're trailing the car ahead by. 1.3 seconds. Okay, they're on old softs. We think they've got one more stop. The last lap time was a 1 minute 17.7. Perfect job from you and the crew there, mate. We're delighted with that. That was our last stop. No more scheduled pit stops. Let's go. Okay, that's Pastor ahead. Okay, they're on fresh hards. Their tyres are just one lap old. Time last lap was a 134.4. Car behind by 18.6 seconds. Okay, they're on old softs. Okay, they've done 15 laps on those tyres. We think they've got one more stop. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 19.8. Our ahead is 1.8 seconds. The car behind's just boxed for mediums. The car behind on the medium tyre now.
on fresh hards. Perez is behind you. And the gap behind us is 1.9 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. Their tyres are just one lap old. The last lap time was a 1.34.1. We need to get past here, use overtake, use overtake. Russell has just put up the fastest lap of the race so far. Our gap to the car in front is 9.1 seconds. Pastors behind you. Okay, the gap behind is 0.8 seconds. Okay, they're on fresh hards. Okay, they've got four laps on their tyres. The time last lap was a 1 minute 16.1. Hamilton ahead. Okay, gap ahead is 4.7 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. And the time last lap was a 1.15.5. Take button more, it's time to utilize some of this energy. Come on.
Okay, here's the gap that we're trailing the car ahead by. 1.6 seconds. ahead. Our gap to the car in front is 9.6 seconds. They're on old mediums. Their tyres are 16 laps old. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 16.3. This is great. We're gaining by around 9 tenths a lap. Keep it up. dropping due to wear, so don't be too aggressive.
is probably dropping due to wear, so don't be too aggressive. Conditions look stable at the moment, no rain currently expected. OK, dry seem like the best tyre for now. out of this race. Final lap, final lap, push, push. I'll take that. Well done. We're really happy with the podium down here. So well done. Yes. What a great race then and a magnificent victory here at the Dutch Grand Prix. Natalie Pinkham, how do you think they were able to set themselves apart today? I feel consistency was probably the key today. There's being quick and then there's being quick lap after lap after lap. If you can do that, you can capitalise on other people's errors without making many of your own. And that's an approach that can push you a long way up the field. Well, Mercedes are on top form once again after an excellent race weekend. It's great to see them up on that podium once again. how the driver's standings have changed. Surfer Girl increases their championship lead. So then, Natalie Pinkham, who would you rank as your driver of the day? I have to give it to Surfer Girl. They did a great job at getting the very most out of the tyres without losing pace. Something that's a very handy skill to have in modern Formula One. Let's move on to the constructors. The owner-driver's team moved to the top of the table. After an event like that, who knows what the sport has in store for us next time out. Be sure to join us once again as we continue to bring you all the excitement of Formula One.